With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hi everyone, let's take a question. So here the question is, here we have the benzene and its reaction with the N-propyl chloride in the presence of aluminium chloride. We have P, then we have O2 by heating, then we have H2O, then we have the formation of the product Q and the phenol. So we want to know the major products P and Q are, okay. So now here when we have is the benzene ring, okay. So before that here what we will see is we have the N-propyl chloride that is this one. Okay, so when it reacts with the aluminium chloride, okay, when it reacts with the aluminium chloride, so here what we will have is, here we will have minus AlCl4 minus, here we will have the formation of CH3, CH, CH2 plus, here we have is the H. Okay, this is our N-propyl carbocation which is less stable. So here what we will have is 1,2 hydride shift. Here we will have 1,2 hydride shift. Okay, so when we have the 1,2 hydride shift, so here we will have the formation of the isopropyl carbocation. This is more stable. This is more stable. Okay, so when we have the isopropyl carbocation, now this carbocation will show the reaction with the benzene ring. So here we have the benzene ring plus here what we have CH3, here we have CH, here we have CH3. Okay, so here what we will have is we will have the formation of, okay, here what we will have, we will have the formation of the, here we will have like this, here we have this, here we have CH, here we have CH3, here we have CH3, okay, by the removal of the minus H plus, okay, by the removal of minus H plus, here we will also have, okay, so here we had the formation of this isopropyl benzene, okay, this is our isopropyl benzene or we can say the cumene. So this is our P structure. It can be represented like this also. Here we have this, sorry. Here we have is the this, this and here we have this. Okay, so this is our isopropyl benzene. If we see it means A and B is incorrect, we will have the answer from the C and D. So now this isopropyl benzene here we have this, okay, here we have is the C, here we have H, here we have CH3, here we have CH3. So here first we have is the O2, 368 to 408 Kelvin. Here we have aerial oxidation. When we have the aerial oxidation, we will have the formation of cumene hydroperoxide. This is cumene hydroperoxide. Here we have CH3, CH3. Okay, here what we have dilute H2SO4. Okay, here now we will have is the formation of the this product. That is the phenol plus CH3, C double bond O, CH3. It means this is our Q. That is the acetone. It means this is incorrect. This one is our correct answer. So here our correct answer is the C option. C is our correct answer. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.